Because remember, the rapture itself does not have a sign. In other words, it can happen anytime. Anytime. But we have a final place beyond which it cannot go. We said the other day, if you, if you take that day when he walked out of the temple, I study AD, some have said 29 AD. I said, if you take the range of 4 BC to 2 BC for his birth, somewhere you will come to the range of what we say. And if we're just taking an average and we come to 30 AD, 2000 from there will come to 2030. And from now, from 2020 to 2030, is 10 years. Which means that it cannot exceed 10 years before the man of sin is revealed. Because you have seven years. Either after that, now here's, here are the three options. Seven years, either after, or within or across <laughs> do you understand if it is after then you have before he comes back will be seven plus ten that's 17 years before jesus comes back seven for the tribulation ten years before the antichrist shows up see that so 17 years in all and Jesus shows up if it is after if it is inside you have three years before he shows up if it is across you have six and a half years before he shows up but because 2020 has gone past six months already <laughs> You're in September. That means you have just six years. Which means, if it doesn't happen in three years, it might be six. If it doesn't happen in six, it cannot exceed ten. There has never been a time in the history of the world when the rupture of the church has been so close. As we witness firsthand the unfolding of biblical prophecies and events, we declare in one accord, even so, come Lord.